Welcome back to Happy Place Cooking. Today, I am going to be making copycat Panera broccoli and cheddar soup. And I am even going to put them in the bread bowls just like you would get at Panera Bread. In fact, the bread bowls actually did come from Panera. I did not make those. I am, however, going to make the soup. This is going to be so fun. I love getting this soup in the bread bowls at Panera. First thing I'm going to do is shred up some carrots. I don't know how many carrots it will take. I only need a half a cup, and I'm thinking it may be just the two. So, I'm going to start by removing the outer skin of the carrot. Now, Jessie is not a huge fan of carrots at all. However, he loves the broccoli and cheddar soup at Panera. And honestly, he's not really a fan of broccoli much either. So I'm hoping he likes this as much as the Panera soup. I'm going to go ahead and shred this first carrot. I might have to cut these down a little bit. I don't think I want these too big. Definitely think one carrot was probably plenty. Next, I'm going to take this bag of frozen broccoli florets and I'm going to chop those up pretty small. Some of these are already chopped somewhat small. You can definitely use fresh if you would like. I'm adding four cups of chicken stock. And I've got a half a teaspoon of salt, a half a teaspoon of black pepper, and one teaspoon of garlic. Stir all that together. And I'm going to put this on high and let it come to a boil. I'll reduce the heat and I'm going to let it simmer until my carrots and everything is nice and cooked. While I am waiting on my... Uh, broccoli and carrots to get cooked. I'm gonna go ahead and prep my cheese. Uh, I need six ounces of white cheddar. This is six ounces, but it's supposed to be shredded. Well, I didn't think to tell the Mennonite lady that I bought it from to not slice it, so it's sliced. I'm not gonna try to shred this up. my broccoli and carrots are finishing up cooking, I'm going to get started on the cheesy sauce part that goes into, into them. I'm going to melt two tablespoons of butter, two tablespoons of flour, stir that around, let that cook a little bit, Some heavy cream. And I am going to use the whole pint. Slowly add my cream. Keep stirring. Don't want it to get lumpy. This is going to be pretty thick. I'm going to let this uh, get a little bit thicker. Just keep stirring it. It's on low heat. Okay, this is getting pretty thick. I'm actually going, I turned it up on a medium heat to get it to really boil up a little bit. Now it's really getting nice and thick. I'm gonna turn it back down to a low heat and I'm going to add my cheddar. Stir this all in and I'm going to stir it occasionally until this cheddar is nice and melted. Shouldn't take too terribly long. Now I'm going to directly add my 
cheese mixture to my broccoli and carrots. Stir this all up. I'll turn the heat down a little bit and let it simmer for a little while. Probably another good 30 minutes or so. I do believe this soup is done. I'm gonna get it plated up. As I said, I bought the bread bowls from Panera Bread. As you can see, they are not cut, so I'm going to have to cut them. I don't have one of those fancy things they use at Panera, so I am going to use a knife and do the best I can to cut this out nice and round. Well, that wasn't too bad. Now I'm gonna fill them up with some soup. There's one of them. There's the other one. Now we are huge bread people. We love bread. So when we go get this at Panera, we always get the side as the baguette so that we have extra bread to dip in our soup. Well, I got this little thing of French bread. We were going to just use bowls and dip these in and we happen to be around Panera today and I'm like, oh, let's get the bowls because I love the bread bowls. But there's some extra breads to go along. I'm actually, I think, going to take a little piece of bread and dip that in. Mm. Well, I do think it's really good. It's mine, so I can double dip it. But I'm not sure it really tastes like, I'm not sure it really tastes like Panera's. Try just a spoon of it. It's very close very close but I don't think it tastes just like Panera's but it is still really good and it is very chilly outside so this is the perfect cool weather meal. Do you have a favorite recipe of yours that you like to put in bread bowls? What's your favorite soup? Comment below and let me know. Thanks so much for watching. Happy eating!